In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a custom animation in LED Edit K version. In this tutorial, I'm not going into the basics of LED Edit K version. If you would like to know the basics, please check out my tutorial on LED Edit K basics. The links are in the description. Okay, I'm going to create a new project. I'm going to create a layout. Uh, I'm going to use the auto layout feature to create a 32 by 32 pixel LED layout. Save the layout and close the layout editor. Alright, go to the program tab and select the program from the list and go to the custom tab. The first step is to select a color using the color plate. Click on color plate. As you can see, the number of colors uh, that you have selected will be displayed here. I have one color which is the white color, you can see it. I'm going to click on a color plate. You have different color plates which have 8, 16, 32, 64, 128, 256 and custom color plate. Alright, you can click on custom colors and select colors from the custom color plate. If you want two color gradient, you can click on this start color and select a starting color. And you can select the end color, clicking on the end color button and select a color from the color plate. And you can type the levels of change and click OK to create the two color gradient. And click on Add to Color Plate, which will create a gradient. The amount of color segment that added to the color plate will be the amount of gradient levels that you have input here. Uh, I'm going to use the gradient that I have created. Uh, always select a color and you can click on Add to Color Plate to add it to the color plate. If you want to delete the colors, select the segment and click on delete selected color all right you can see the amount of color segments in the count number if you want to clear the whole segment uh, click on clear okay if you want uh, individual colors to be added to the color plate uh, click on the color and Click on Add to the Color Plate. Click on Close. As you can see, the number of colors that I have will be displayed here. Uh, I have selected 50 colors. The action type is the effect that you want to be uh, displayed. Click on the effect from this list. The, I'm going to select the overall change first. For the overall change, you cannot change the direction of the animation. There are several ways to add frames to your animation. You can add frame by frame by clicking on the single frame adding as you can see the overall change of the colors in this animation if you want to quickly add frames to your animation click on continuous setting the other thing is a continuous preview which will preview the animation or skip the animation without recording click and hold your left mouse button to continuous preview and continuous setting. Uh, you can use this continuous preview button to skip the animation. Uh, you can also single frame preview. If you are adding frames which will also means it records the video. If you want to check out what's been recorded click on play button. Okay this is the overall change animation. As you can see the colors that we have selected will be displayed on your layout all right i'm going to pause i'm going to select another animation 
I'm going to click on push change so you can see these uh, directional buttons now available you can select the direction of the push and change effect all right I'm going to select from here uh, I'm going to continue setting as you can see when you continue setting it always start from the beginning so you can see a black screen if you don't want that to be displayed you can skip the animation using the continuous preview button and record it by continuous adding frames all right i'll show you how to do that i'm going to click on continuous preview to skip the animation until it fills the screen as you can see the layout has been uh, fi filled with the animation i'm going to click on continuous setting i'm going to change the direction i'm going to click on continuous preview to fill the layout with the animation and then i'm going to click on continuous adding all right i'm going to change the direction i'm going to click on continuous preview to skip the animation until it fills the screen then i'm going to click on continuous adding I'm going to select different effects and record uh, different effects on the layout. Alright, uh, that's how you record the custom animation. You can select any one of these uh, animation effects and you can skip and you can record the frames. Okay, we we'll play what's been recorded. You can see the overall change animation, then the push change animation. This is the push change animation and on different directions you can see I have skipped the black black screen that is the we change animation effect on different directions if you want to reset the whole segment click on reset which will take some time and if you want to go back while you skipping the animation I'm going to demonstrate it I'm going to select effect and select a direction I'm going to click and hold the continuous preview and if I want to go back on continuous preview click on the back button but when you are clicking on continuous setting if you go back which not gonna delete the frames that you have recorded it only go back on the frame preview you can use the freehand check freehand to draw on the frames using the cursor you can select a color from the color plate or if you want to custom colors click on custom colors click and hold the 
left mouse button and move your mouse cursor to draw on the frames that you have selected using the time slider you can draw anything using your mouse cursor alright that's how you create your custom animation in LED edit K version if you want the and this animation to use later click on export and click on export dot extract which will create the animation file that file for this animation in the documents folder if you go to effect tab open video and you will see the animation inside this extract LED edit K version LED edit K folder all right That's how you create your custom animation in LED Edit K version. Alright, thank you for watching. If you like the video, please leave a like. If you like my channel, please subscribe. If you have any questions, please comment. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.